Get your cards ready! An all-new episode of Mario Kart Deluxe begins right now! Hey guys, rev up your engines! It's time for another exciting episode of Mario Kart Deluxe! I like the girl with the pink ponytails. Definitely standing out, that's for sure. Did she just look at her wrist? <laughs> what was that? Is she looking at her watch or something? Late for a date? I don't know. Oh, and she's wearing glasses too. That's neat. The subway. The dreaded subway. I love how everyone's just staring at it. It's like, oh my god, here we go again. You know what the funny part of this is, right? Even the game doesn't like this track. Look how long it's taking to actually select it. Even the game is like, oh. Here we go again! No, no, no! Oh, jeez. And the girl with the pink ponytail... She's probably gonna end up in first place. Based off the rating here. Whoa, okay. Ah, uh, I want to gravel. Come on, Dry Bowser! Wah! That was almost a head-on collision. Oh, I threw- I could've sworn I threw the boomerang. My rating went up, that's what matters.
Ah, oh, we haven't seen Neo Bowser City in a while. And I am using Dry Bowser, so... Kinda apropos. It's either that or Rainbow Road, so... Pick your poison powder. And we don't get either! We get the volcano! <sighs> oh, jeez. I think there's gonna be a lot of grumbling after this volcano track. Especially since there's a guy with 4700 rating in this. I specifically tried to avoid that, of course. No, that doesn't... I almost hit the fire. Oh, jeez. I got someone. Didn't really make much of a difference in my ranking, though. getting smaller. I'm gonna get hit by this guy. Ah! The pain! Of course, now I'm gonna get hit by this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can actually knock someone out. That works. Of course. The guy with 4,700 ranking ends up in first place. How could we have guessed that? The one guy who picks random. And the male tank are out grazing on the grass again.
Don't throw a banana peel that way. Jeez. Oh, you smarty pants. What the heck is going on? If I didn't know any better, I'd say every single time I threw a shell, it was targeting an item rather than a player. Now I've got a bob bomb. Close. Oh, jeez. Of course. Whoa! Okay. That was close. That was close. The timing is just so convenient. If someone had thrown that blue shell just, I don't know, four seconds earlier, it would have actually knocked Bram out of first place before crossing the finish line. No, had to have gone it four seconds too late. He crosses the finish line, and if I hadn't have crossed the finish line, by, I want to say, two seconds, I would have gone hit, and then I would have ended up in fifth place. I'll say this, as fun as Mario Kart Deluxe is, Sometimes the RNG can be an absolute pain in the rear end. Especially because of the way it's set up. Where players who are essentially at the back of the pack have the highest possible chance of getting blue shells and bullet bills and invincibility stars. Whereas the players in first place pretty much, pretty much guaranteed to never get those items. So the game is more luck-based than skill.
Oh my god, really? Take that! Now if that wasn't epic, I don't know what was. I fell off the track and still managed to cross the finish line all at the same time. Take that, physics! And here we go, our final course of the night, Excite by Track at 150. Or Excite Bike Arena, whichever one you prefer. Of course, we still have to have the 4700 guy in this race. No, no, he couldn't have dropped out. Whoa, almost hit a peel. Ah! Oh, you... What the? I swear to Arceus! Remember, if you guys have any questions or comments, make sure to let us know. Follow us on Twitter, at Toondice, hashtag MK8. And, uh, <laughs> at Toondice. And don't forget to support us on Patreon, patreon.com slash Toondice. Yes! Wow, that was a tough one. <laughs>